Hey everybody, Asa Garrick here, Second Chance Garage, and today we are going to redo this deck lid. Uh, I just got done sanding it down with uh, <clears throat> 80, 150, and finally 400. I'm going to shoot a coat of uh, high build primer on it, and then going to go through and redo the red and the, the mid coat and all that stuff again. Um, and then once all that dries, I'm actually going to attempt to put the stripes on here, at least approximately, in the pattern that I'm looking for for my Camaro, um, which is a, it's a 77 Camaro, but I'm planning on putting the 74 Camaro Z28 stripes on it, um, which are a multicolor stripes, black and white, and pinstriped and everything. But anyway, I'm going to put the primer on here right now. Just about <clears throat> nothing went well with that. Um, as you can see in the camera, both of those coats striped pretty hard. Um, I don't know what the problem was there. Um, the first coat was just laying way too much material on. It was like gigantic ripples of primer over here. Um, so for the second coat, I dialed down the fluid quite a bit. Um, to try and get a cleaner pattern. I think that helped a little bit. Um, and I think as I was coming through here, I think I was holding the gun a little too high like this, so I was putting it on a little heavy on one side. So I kind of tipped it up a little bit as I came across, and I think that worked a little better. So then, um, after I finished the first coat, I was looking through my supplies, and I realized I didn't have any gun cleaner left. I thought I had a full can left 
Um, when I picked it up off the shelf, it was some prep all stuff and not gun cleaner. So I kind of freaked out because I had a, a whole bunch of primer sitting in my good finish line gun with no gun cleaner. Um, so I wasn't quite sure what to do. I did a little Google search and decided to use uh, the clear reducer that I bought. Um, that nice PPG clear reducer. I used that. I think that worked okay. Um, that stuff stinks something fierce, which I hate because it spills all over the place now my garage. Ugh. Just reeks. It's got this really sweet smell. It's kind of an odd chemical. I don't know what it is, but it's kind of scary. Um, when something smells sweet like that, it's a little... I don't know. Anyway, uh, so that's all the painting I can do. I'm not going to keep trying to clean with that stuff. Um, that's not the right thing for that gun. It's a waterborne slash solvent gun, so you got to be careful with the kind of cleaners you use with it and stuff. So hopefully I didn't destroy anything, but uh, this is primer so I can sand it. It's okay. Um, but hopefully the base coat goes on a little bit better than that stuff did. Um, I just don't know why it's striping so bad. Um, that gun just, I don't know, I gotta keep playing with the settings I guess on it to get it to, to spray a nice even fan or something. I'm, I thought I had it dialed in for that second coat but it's all striped too so. Anyway, uh, I think when I go to spray down the base coat I'm gonna just lay down like a white piece of paper over the deck lid and practice on that first and see if I can get that to lay out clean. I don't know. Um, if any of you guys saw anything there um, I mean, let me know what you think. I'll give you a close-up of the panel. You can see what happened. So as I was saying here on the first coat, the stuff went on so thick. Um, I didn't really think I was going very slow across the panel, but it just it was doing this as I was going across. It was like, wow, just way too much material. Um, you can see it again there, perhaps. I don't know if the camera will pick that up right there. Um, you know, overall, it, it's pretty smooth. It's not peely or anything, but uh, it's just got those stripes in it. And it's primer. You know, I wouldn't have thought you're supposed to strike primer. Maybe it's drying too fast or something. I don't know. Um, anyway, uh, that's going to do it for today because, uh, like I said, I don't want to destroy my paint gun. So I'm going to go off and do other things about the house this weekend, I guess, and not be working on any of this stuff. So anyway, take it easy, guys.